the engineer who was in charge of it, right before everything started, was looking at the tires and they were checking on the side after they got some heat into them. He's looking at it and he's like, something's not right. And then he figured it out. They had used the molds for the Indianapolis tires to make these tires. So they weren't the right tires. They brought over a couple thousand of the wrong tires for this amazing Ford effort. And sure enough, the GT40s are out there. The first Mark II comes in for a fuel stop and the Goodyear engineer looking at the back and he sees a bald tire on the back of this thing. And he's all like, you gotta change the tires. You gotta change the tires. And Shelby's like, no, don't change the tires. He's like, no, you gotta change the tires. And they start changing the tires. He goes back and he just sits in the trailer. He's like, what am I gonna do? I've got thousands of the wrong tire. My days are over at Goodyear. Remington, who was kind of helping run the, the, the program, comes over to him and he's like, it's okay. It's all right. He's like, what do you mean it's okay? He's all, cars aren't gonna last. Like they knew, they knew it wasn't gonna work out. And by midnight, all the GT40s were dead.